because he loves Jesus just like you and me. So Jan, tell us, what do you love about Jesus? I love that Jesus is alive. Yes, Jesus is alive. But I don't know if you did this at home or not, but I hope you did. If you have your palm branches, you're going to need them for this service. Are you ready to have them in your hand? Wave them, wave them, wave them in the air. Wave them right up. Wave them low, low, low. But Did make sure you don't enjoy that. You don't know enjoy that? Me neither. Did your mom and dad enjoy that? Probably not. Wow, but what we're gonna do now is worship. Yes, that's my favorite part. Mine too, because that's when we say, Jesus, we love you because you are alive. So let's sing together. Yep, yep, yep. I get scared sometimes, so I cover my eyes.
Wasn't worship fun today? I really enjoyed it so much. And today is a very, very, very special day. You know why? Jaden, do you know why? Is it your birthday? Because if it is, I didn't get anything. No, it is not my birthday. But today is Palm Sunday. Do you see all the palms that you did this week? The things that you made? Well, today in our lesson, we're going to learn what those things mean and why we made them and why are they so important in Jesus' story. Are you ready? Let's go to the clubhouse. Who? Who? You know what time it is? It's time to hear a story full of wonder. There's so much fun we'll have learning together. So let's go down, go down to the clubhouse with Holly and his friends. Let's go down, down, down to the clubhouse where wonder never ends at the Wonder Clubhouse. We miss you at the Wonder Clubhouse. We miss you. flower pots. Each one of us put our favorite things on ours. Let's see, here's Poppy's. It's a rainbow sparkle unicorn. It's a giant chocolate chip cookie. Devin loves chocolate chip cookies. This is Lucy's. It's her favorite thing. It's Lolly, her pet parrot. Those are all super cool things, but mine is the very best. See, I put the moon and sun and stars on it because I love outer space. Houston, Houston, this is Kai. Do you hear me? I love my outer space flower pot and I can't wait to plant these flower seeds in it. Who, who? It's Ollie. Hello, Kai. Who, who? Got your head in the stars, do you? Hi, Ollie. Look at my special flower pot. I'm going to put dirt inside and plant these seeds. What a beautiful pot. Who, who? I know something even more special for you. So let's hear this story. Just follow me through. Who, who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Who? Okay, just a little more water. There we go. Oh, <laughs> hi friends. Stormy Jane, it's our friends. Right. Hi everybody, I'm Carrie and this is my best dog, Stormy Jane. We were just doing a little gardening, making sure everything looked nice because today is a very special day, celebrating someone really special. It's Palm Sunday. <laughs> Stormy Jane loves Palm Sunday. I think we should tell them the story. What do you think, Stormy? Stormy, where are you going? Oh, you got a palm branch. Smart dog. You need a palm branch if you want to tell the Palm Sunday story. Hey, do you have your palm branch? Raise it high. Let's wave it around. <laughs> okay, let's tell the story. Palm Sunday started in the city of Jerusalem, and it was like any other Sunday. The townspeople were all going about their normal day, until someone announced that Jesus was coming to town. They were so surprised and so excited. They had heard of Jesus and that he can do anything. He made a storm stop just by saying stop. They had heard that he made sick people better and that he could feed a whole group of people with only a little bit of food. Yay, Jesus! Everybody wave your palm branches. Jesus can do anything. He is so special and if he was coming to town, then they needed to do something special to celebrate him. So some people got palm branches and some took off their coats and laid them in the street to give Jesus a special place to ride. And then they saw him. He was here. They waved their palm branches. Let's wave our palm branches, ready? And then they shouted, Hosanna, Hosanna, yay, Jesus. Can you say that? Try it. Hosanna, Hosanna, yay, Jesus. Again? Hosanna, Hosanna, yay, Jesus. The people were celebrating Jesus because they knew he was so special. 
everyone was so excited for Jesus to be there. Moms and dads and grandparents and teachers and children, they were celebrating Jesus. Let's celebrate him too. Wave your palm branches. Jesus is so special. And Jesus is alive today and loves when you and me and all of us celebrate him. So one more time, all together, let's say Hosanna, Hosanna, yay Jesus, as loud as we can. Are you ready? One, two, three. Hosanna, Hosanna, yay Jesus. <laughs> hey there, Ollie. Ollie, tell me, who is alive? Jesus is alive. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who is alive? Jesus is alive. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Happy Palm Sunday. <laughs> Bye. So there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus is super special, so we can all celebrate. You and me, too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow, Jesus is so amazing and special. We can all celebrate him. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it. Good. I think my flower pot is pretty special, but Jesus is even more special. I can't wait to get planting and see these flowers grow. See you guys next time, bye. Whoa, that was just amazing. Can you imagine all of these people with palm branches saying, Hosanna, Hosanna, welcome Jesus. I think that that is just amazing. And that's something that you and I can do. We can say, Jesus, you are welcome in our hearts. You are welcome in our lives. We want to be your friends because he is alive. So who is alive? Jesus. Who is alive? Jesus is alive. And today I want to teach you our memory verse for this month. Are you ready? Stand up. Everybody stand up because we are going to do this. I am alive forever and ever. Revelation 118. I am alive forever and ever. Revelation 118. Good job. One more time. I am alive forever and ever. You are alive because Jesus is alive. See you next week.